wondering if Tua is actually good or if this is a fraud. They played their first three games. Uh, it's fucking amazing. Like I've been telling you for two years. He threw 160 yards. No, it was more than that, number one. No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. It was 180-something. How is that good? It, it gets the – Tommy, yeah, he's 9-1. and one. He's 9-1 one 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 in his last 10. Miami's defense Give the fucking guy a break. Miami's defense is 9-1. Jesus. Miami's defense is 9-1. Admit nine it. He's fucking good. When Jimmy Garoppolo had 12-win season, no one gave him credit. Right? No, they he did. Gave the Niners defense credit. Debo Samuel got credit. But now Tua we're going to do it a credit. Tua Tua is good, bro. He's good. Not good. The defense is good. All right, well, nine, nine, and, one, scored 19 nine points. and one in my last 10 is good. And what did I tell you yesterday before that game started? I don't remember. But I thought Miami was going to win. I was blacked out the whole weekend. Well, I told you the same thing. I thought that the lines, and I even said this to Rackets, the lines screamed Colts in Miami. They were completely trap lines. The lines Buffalo, screamed Colts in Miami. Buffalo, couldn't, was, Buffalo and, couldn't have done anything more in that game to win. The Josh Allen threw for 400 yards. The Bills laid, were without four DBs. They, had they five, laid it they all threw, out they on the field. I'm talking about points. the guys on the field. Yeah, but they, they scored 19 it points. all out on the field yesterday. No, they played good. Listen, we said it. Playing at Miami is fucking a nightmare. At Miami's tough. Players are going out partying in South Beach. They were missing five defensive backs. Everyone loses. That's why the NFL is so stupid because it was it was ninety, dude. It was ninety-five degrees and humid. Players were cramping up. Stefan Diggs left the field like three times. Linemen were walking off the field with leg cramps. Like that's a tough place to play, dude. If it gets hot in Miami, that humidity at this time of year, it's a huge home field advantage. It's like it's like playing in Denver with the altitude. That that's why these fucking people are morons, these announcers and everybody <clears throat> else, saying, oh, is Buffalo going to go undefeated? Are they going to go undefeated? It's fucking three weeks in, they have a loss. I, I, I was yelling at my dad undefeated. yesterday about that yesterday. He's They're like, going to lose could... at least four games, bro. <laughs> Come Dude, on. Undefeated. Yeah, I'm going to lose six. That's all I need them to not lose. I think there's only two undefeated teams in the league right now. Miami and... Giants. Yeah. We were talking about it last week, man. Giants I watched three and 3-0 tonight. I watched the Colts try and do this for five, six years in a row and get to 13, 12, 11. The Bills were never fucking close. Well, to Every player on that yeah, fucking – I watched that whole game yesterday. Every single player on that field from both sides was dead. Dude, it was and 95 both, degrees with 80% humidity. And they played their asses off. And Miami's That's not even on the field play. either. <laughs> What's up? That's not even on the field either. It's way yeah, hotter and more humid on the field. Yeah, it's outside, yeah. So, I mean, listen, that was a gig- every The stars aligned for the Dolphins yesterday because Tua didn't play good at all. Um, they didn't do anything at all. Uh, they benefited from a couple of fluke plays. And, you know, they, they ended up winning. I mean, I don't even know how they ended up winning, honestly. You're but- out of your mind. Let's go!